Hi everyone, this is Gene from Mahalo.com. Today I'm going to be showing you how to compose your photos using the Crop and Rotate tools in the PhotoGene app on your Apple iPad. Before we get started, let's talk briefly about composition. The main reason that we'll be cropping or rotating our images is to make them more interesting to the eye. One of the first things that you learn as a designer is the rule of thirds. This rule basically says that if you cut your image into three equal sections, vertically and horizontally, you should place the most important elements of your image along the lines that are formed between the parts. Let me show you what I mean. Here's a simple image. If we cut it into thirds vertically, we get this. Now if we again cut it into thirds horizontally, we're left with two lines up and two across. Basically, you want to lay a tic-tac-toe board over your image. Let's take a look at how this applies to Photogene. First, select the image that you'd like to edit. Now, select the Crop tool from the far left of the menu. From the right side of the screen comes a menu where you can select the ratio that you would like your image size to be. It has the most common settings ready for you, and there's an option to select a different ratio, or you can simply select the option at the top which lets the Crop tool move freely. Once you have a ratio set, you can grab the corners of the Crop tool to resize the window, and you can drag inside of the window to move it around. As you can see, the Photogene app has indicators for the rule of thirds built right into their crop tool. So if we take our image with this new knowledge, we can easily select a composition that will place our main subject along these lines. Right next to the crop tool on the main menu bar is the rotate tool. Here you can flip your image horizontally and vertically, and you can also turn it 90 degrees in either direction. Below the rotate icons is a straighten bar, where you can fine tune the rotation of your image. As always, if you aren't satisfied with your changes, you can hit Reset to restore your image to its default rotation, Undo in the top left of your screen to take back a series of changes, or the original button that will totally restore your image to its default position. That's all for now. Please remember to comment, rate, and subscribe below, and email any requests you may have to requests at mahalo.com. Thanks for watching.